Send it up to uh, Grand are made. Let's take a look at the tail of the tape. Both men, 22 years old. The height advantage clearly going to Bakhbarov. We'll see if it makes a difference. 5-1 and 3-1. And and when you 
you're looking for records. Both fighters fighting in black but with a white trim is Andrian. And already Circu Andrian pushing the pressure and really going after Bakhbarov. I feel like there should be a rule that they can't wear the exact same tights. Or, 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 or we can just make one grow a beard and then make the other one wear a knee brace. And then we know who's who. Yeah. <laughs> well, you're, you're right. Both with black shorts. It would never happen in a boxing match back in the day. No, this is very true. Quite an intense start, yeah? Ooh, work of the body there is... Great call there from the ref, you know? And that's exactly what I was saying earlier on, uh, uh, Cyrus, about that bottom rope. You know, we've got four ropes here. An MMA ring would have a fifth rope at the bottom to stop them, or to try to stop them sliding underneath. Um, so the referee was quite on point there. Circle Andrian looking to avoid some ground and pound and finish his opponent quickly. Three and one fighter. I was, I was just making the comment he's actually a firefighter outside of the sport. So he, just, so he likes he likes to fight with a knee bar. Look at the knee bar. Bakhmarov going for a finish. Always tough to complete the leg locks, but he went after it. A risky move, and now he is right back on bottom. That is the risk you take going for the leg submission, the foot submissions, is that you tend to give up your position almost every time by taking that chance. It's very, very difficult to finish with it. Circo Andrian needs an up kick from Bakhbarov. Dead set on getting inside there to point ground and pound. And Bakhbarov has had a few opportunities to possibly spring to his feet, but has elected to stay on the ground. I don't know if that was the best choice. Both men with only one loss on their record. Very young fighter, 22 years old, both of them. This is a uh, fight between countries as Bulgaria takes on Moldova. Circo Andrian back on top. Are we going to get a stand up here? I'd like to see this fight get stood back up. Circo Andrian is dead set in 10. Get him in there and try to finish the fight. And again, it's a difficult judgment call from the referee. He'll restart them now because of the ropes. You see, these guys, Eastern Europeans, you're going you're gonna to see a lot more leg locks in countries like Russia. You know, and with the soccer Yeah, exactly. Um, now, you see when they were stood up there, one guy's got hold of an ankle, and he looks like he's trying to punch, but he could be setting up an Achilles crush, a, a figure four or a knee bar, something. He's got it in his mind. The referees over here will be much more aware of that than perhaps. Uh, he's jumping the doctor out from the bottom and kick and a few punches. And looks like momentarily stunned Circu Andrian. And here comes those left hands, those pissing like left hands coming down on the face of Bakhbarov. He's going for it again, Grant. Can he wrench it back to finish the fight? He seems very confident to do so. He's got, his leg is twisted. I and mean, even though it's a position like that would be painful on the knee, that... Now did he? Yeah. I think that's hot, but now he's on top. Nice move by Bakhbarov. Crafty grappler. I mean, Bakhbarov is, is the submission guy in this bout, is he not? No, without a doubt. He, he's been going after it the entire time. He really has no intent on standing up and throwing. An arm bar there. Now we got the yes. arm bar it looks like we got a finish, and we do Sergio Andrian <laughs> with the tap. Yes, dude. Great win. And that, he was relentless, wasn't he? You know, leg lock. Uh, you know, he's, he's chasing, chasing. He would it reminds not... me of the first fight with Derek Nolan. He just he was going after it the whole time, never really sat back. And... <laughs> but he wasn't a one-trick pony. No, he certainly wasn't. And that's what won in that fight. No, you're absolutely right. Sergio Andrian, the young fighter from Moldova, now moves to 4-1. and one.
a great performance here. Leading the Bulgarian fighter Bakhmarov. A quick finish. Our second prelim fight is in the books. We have one more prelim for you in the welterweight division. Then we will get to our main card, which will include a one-night Muay Thai tournament. The winner moving on to the Kings Cup in December in Bangkok, Thailand, as well as our Road to Abu Dhabi Warriors tournament. Here to give us our official decision is Granite Grant Waterman. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Four minutes, 40 seconds on the very first round. We have a winner by way of armor, Santo Andrian. And a great win by Circu Andrian. Once again, moving to four and one. A dominating performance. Withstood a few attempts on the knee bar and on the Achilles was able to survive and pull off a submission of his own. So a very gritty performance by the Moldovan fighter. More to come here from Sofia, Bulgaria, in the Armets Arena as we take a look at the replay. Nasty little arm bar. He yanked it back. 